What's up guys? Today we are watching season 3 episode 5 of Breaking Bad. So last episode Jesse ended up doing business with Gus and to be honest I was kind of surprised by it but you know they did the work together. Well Jesse did the work he just did the deal with them but they only gave Jesse part of his money and gave the other part to Walt and I felt bad for Jesse about that because he did make the shit on his own but they're also still trying to find a way to keep Walt like in the business so that's mostly just on them and last episode Walt did end up getting fired from his job because he made a move on the principal and I don't I don't blame her he was being crazy as fuck last episode but I am ready to see how Jesse and Walt are gonna like feel about the whole situation happening since you know they're still trying to keep Walt in the game. So I guess let's just get into the episode. Buy the RV. We start tomorrow. Why is it taking us back this far? Yo, this is sick, bro. Okay, then. <laughs> so, if if Jesse blew the money away, how did he buy the RV? Oh, damn. I only got like 1400 Waffle House? And you really blew all that shit away. And that's your fault, bro. Yo, RV, yeah? I can hook you up, bro. I can totally get you an RV. No, I need it today. If he gets you one for $1,400, Walt literally just wasted all that money for nothing. Right on. So, do I need to sign something or something? Nah, it's like a no paperwork type deal. So he really got him a damn RV for 1400 Walt got ripped off. The other dude seems like he was in a hurry, so did he actually just like steal the RV or something? Oh my god. I love this floor. Mm -hmm. This feels fantastic. Are you at other dude's place? Ted? This has got to be the most amazing invention ever so we're back to present time right yeah um, mom's asking want to come to dinner uh, yeah I i'll be right <laughs> a man's in the fucking closet what the fuck you're not listening to me i don't know uh yeah right like you don't know what did i just say Give me the phone. Oh, oh, they're talking about the thing. Of money through my window. Whatever, man, you owe me that money. Well, let me tell I you. I owe you. I owe you nothing. And I will get to the bottom of this, trust me. Oh. So you're going to keep the money. <laughs> Hank's checking out the RV. Wait, is that Jesse's? It I don't think it is. Hey, hey, hey. 
what way did you suddenly find because I also have no idea how you could tell but again I don't think it's his since Or not, I don't know. They look similar, kinda. I just didn't think Jesse would park it there. Like, I thought he would park it somewhere else. Well, where exactly else could he park it? <laughs> Hank, that is such an intrusion. How are you gonna explain that whenever you get they're gonna report that how's your boss gonna take that you can't keep doing shit like this so i guess they're understanding all right tell you what i'm gonna check out a couple more then we're gonna call in the morning okay what do you say can't gotta get home Might you leave your balls in your wife's purse or what he's been out all night pack for what where you headed? Texas. Oh, so he's gonna go in place of Hank? Okay. Hank? Just openly ignore your wife like that, Hank. You didn't even wait for an answer. You just, can I come in? Open the door. How do you feel about that? Turn it down. End the story. Good. Good. Jesus, God knows I'm relieved. Yeah, well, I need to some- But I mean, is he, is he gonna feel bad for his friend? Cause maybe he could get, something can happen to him and then he can have PTSD like Hank. Put on someone before you nuke him. Jesus, Marie. I made a decision. I'm not going through anything. Doing my job. That's kind of fucked up to say. She's just trying to help you, bro. With it. Anyone who doubts that. I'm not doing some actual good out here. And all I get are these bullshit accusations. But everyone thinks I would jerk. It is wild that he is so angry about that when she's just trying to make sure he's okay. Would hire an addict. Jesse Pinkman? Recovering or not? You vouched for him previously. I took you at your own. No, 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 no. He got you there because you did vouch for him. At best. I am told his product was more or less consistent with the quality I had come to expect. More or less? He's getting so offended. Am I left to draw? that you believe I have some proprietary kind of selfishness about my own formula. Is he wrong though? Why would you be, why would you like go off on Jesse about it if you weren't? Or maybe it was kind of about the fact that it would just bring the name back, like the Heisenberg name back. Would you take a drive with me? I'd like to show you something. Is he gonna show him the warehouse or something? Hi, is everything okay? She's already finished an entire bottle, but she still seemed hungry and she fell asleep. But I was thinking I'd give her another when she wakes up. Damn, so she didn't leave the baby with Hank. I mean, not Hank, Walt. I was thinking about Hank since I saw Marie. Thanks, Marie. Are you, are you sure you're okay? Are you gonna bring up Hank? Talk about it. It's Hank. Hank, what about him? I don't know. How to talk to him. Yeah? He's not going, Steve Gomez is going in his place and I don't know how I feel about that. What do you mean? He won't talk to me. 
He hardly even comes home. He works all day, all night, barely eats, barely speaks to me. It's like something's eating him away from me. He's trying to keep himself distracted. Facing death, it changes a person. It has to, don't you think? I guess you've noticed a change in Walt. See, I was about to say what you mean by that, and then I remembered Walt has cancer, so. Please. So I was right, he's showing him the factory thing. That stairs down to a... That is a fucking great hiding spot. What is this? Your new lab. That's a lab. So they're not gonna need the RV anymore if he gets back into that. But it's like, will Jesse be doing it with him? Thorium oxide. For a catalyst bed. They got him all he fucking needs, and they're doing what he says because it's like he says that he respects the chemistry, and they got him the shit that he actually likes to use for that stuff. I've owned it for years. It receives large chemical deliveries on a weekly basis, detergents and such. There is nothing suspicious about it. And that makes it perfect to hide. Fuck. So it's like, how would he get caught now? 200 pounds per week to make this economically viable. You would choose your own hours, of course. Come and go as you please. He's flexible, okay. So look, you kind of seem like you have a good bit of benefits right now. Sorry. Answer is still no. And that's surprising. Because you seem like you really want to do it. Because you're so impressed with all this stuff. Walt. A man provides for his family. This costs me my family. That's how you're going to get him back in. You're just going to keep showing him. You have to keep doing this to provide for them. But you like the floor. You want to take her? That's some improvement. Okay. Classic. Wait, did he? He didn't just come back, right? That has to be like a going away thing. Is that the last one? Sorry, Hank, that's all DMV had. 29 early 80s bounders registered in New Mexico. Oh, wait, yeah, now that I thought about it, I was thinking that they were to find Jesse's name, but he didn't do it like that like how they were trying to like find him so he's kind of safe more rv dmv said the registration wasn't renewed but then they realized it was never filed as non-operation or destroyed no police report either god damn it please please don't be for jesse or like at least the dude that he bought it from
What are you going to do? Just look at the money? He already showed it to you. Are you going to... I don't think you'd steal it. God, I could go for a glass of wine about now. You want to go to... Sorry, never mind. I'm going to ask your attorney to go <laughs> get a drink with you. My own sister, my brother-in-law, my, my, my teenage son tells me I'm a bitch. Because you can't tell him the truth. So, he knows about this other man? So then, he'll sign? I don't think so. He was still being stubborn about it. Your husband? The drug dealer. How much money? I didn't count it. It's it's heavy. God damn it. Mm. So what is she gonna say? Bring it somehow? Maybe what he did. He, he did it for the family, right? Well, guess what? That is one enormous load of horseshit. Is it though? I mean, that was literally his reason, like, reasoning for doing it. All courtesy of this criminal, you refused to divorce. I didn't marry a criminal. Well, you're married to one now. It's wild how it could change like that, because, like she said, she didn't marry a criminal. He just became one to provide for his family. Um, why is it so cleaned up like that? Wait, did Walt leave? Because the bag's gone. Unless someone knows she found it. Do they still have the house bugged? Like Saul in them? He did not sign it. That stubborn man signed it? For what? Why? What changed his mind? Oh wait, is it because he's giving in to the thing? Downs. I should give you a card. How with this? I'm out of here. What? He's here. So they're gonna get back into business together. Really? 10% of all future profits from his solo venture money you get paid for walking down to the mailbox nah he's getting back in Isaac you two had come to a parting of the ways take it it belongs to you you're damn right it belongs to me I knew okay so why because he knows he's gonna make it back spend it in good health that is the last money you'll ever earn in this business the hell's that supposed to mean? He's not going to be his partner anymore because he's going to be working for Gus. So then, what about Jesse? Mutual associate was only using you to get to me. Sorry, Jesse. Yeah. Let's see, how should I put this? I'm in. You're out. You cocky bitch. That's how you're going to tell him like that? Hmm. That's uh, three million for three months of my time. What well, you, you're going to need that money laundered, right? I mean, of course. For only three months? Okay. I thought it was going to be longer than that. Five. I'm a reasonable guy. It's a short-term deal. Ten even. But I can't go any lower and still respect myself. Five. Oh, look what you just did. That's the way of the world, kid. Go with the winner. But don't even think about using my formula. You just try and stop me, bitch. 
so you go from partners to enemies so quick. <laughs> he just got that bitch fixed. Come on, Jesse. We're interested in an RV that's registered to your name and address. Um, do, you, uh, do you have an RV? I did. It was stolen months ago. That's what I was saying earlier. The dude looked like he was in a hurry, so he actually stole it. Was it... Was it because it's her son or something? He was never a bad person. I thought he could turn his life around. How are we talking about, Mr. Ortega? My son. So dude stole from his parents to give that... Yeah, dude died. Fuck. Well, that's still kind of good in our favor, so he doesn't get caught, but... He's still gonna get caught anyway. Thanks for this, I, I really appreciate it. Jesse's fucked. Where did he park it? Jesse's fucked, man. Oh, what? How? How do you like? He's associated with the dude, so he's gonna know it's Jesse because he already suspected him, like, of the other shit last season. My God, why does it never work out in Jesse's favor? Why does Jesse always get the shit in? Like, Walt's getting away with everything, and it's like Jesse seems like he was doing the right, like, the thing to like not be obvious but then hank is smart not calling jesse dumb but like how is nothing working out for that dude like i feel so bad and it's just wild now that jesse and walt aren't working together anymore like walt's now working for gus getting three million for only three months and i thought he was going to be working way longer than that he might, you never know, because, like, shit could change, but, like, I just, I just feel so bad for Jesse, because it's like he tried to do the business on his own, he didn't use his own formula, so he's kind of fucked with that, but it's like, what is he supposed to do? No one's gonna want to buy his stuff, because Walt's gonna be selling, and it's like, mmm, it's like competition in the drug in industry, even though it always has been. I mean, they're looking for the best product. <sighs> it's just a whole fucking thing, man. Like, I didn't think that Hank would get something this quick because he's been on this shit for two episodes now and he found it. Well, he's been on the whole thing longer than that, but it's like, I, f I didn't think it was gonna be such short notice until he got to Jesse. Like, I was hoping he didn't find anything at the ATM last episode. Only thing he found was the RV, so I thought we were fine. But no, they went to the owner who was associate who had a son associated with Jesse. What are the chances? Mm, it pisses like it kind of pisses me off, but it's just wild how that works, how it all connected like that. Because now he's gonna be going after Jesse again, and it's like. So yeah, he's gonna have to pick up Jesse again. And what is he gonna do this time? Is, I was gonna say, is Saul gonna help him stay out of jail? But I'm assuming so because he's like still Jesse's lawyer, but like morally like on Hank. I was about to call him Hank. He was more on Walt's side, even though that's just like business wise, but like, I swear, I was just thinking, would Jesse potentially give up Walt? But that wouldn't be smart in his, in his way because yeah, 
it could be a way for Walt to go to jail, but then that would also mean he would be going to jail too. There's just so much that could potentially happen, but I just don't know what would happen. <sighs> My mind is just, mm, because I just want to know what's going to happen with Jesse. Like, Hank is going to go hard on that dude again and still not even figure out about Walter. Why does Walt get away with everything? Shit. Yeah, I guess I just want to see what's going to happen with that whole situation. So come back for episode six. <laughs>